Renault Float The Renault Float, a futuristic concept car, is the brainchild of Yu Chen Kai, a graduate of Shanghai Jiao Tong University. This innovative design won a competition organized by French automotive brand Renault and students of MA Industrial Design at Central St. Martins in London. The float is a vision of the car of the future, designed to be more of a social space. It features large swathes of glass, allowing for greater connection with the outside world. The float is non-directional, meaning it can move in any direction at any time without needing to turn around. The design allows for pods for one or two people which can be attached via a magnetic belt that runs around the exterior, enabling more than two people to travel together. The float also comes with a smartphone app, allowing users to rent a float at the touch of a button. This could very well be the future of car design. Sky Hotel the Sky Hotel, a concept that has captured the imagination of millions. This futuristic idea, often referred to as the Sky Cruise or Flytanic, is a nuclear-powered hotel that floats in the sky. The concept was created by Hashim Al-Ghaili, who was inspired by his dissatisfaction with modern airplanes and his love for Studio Ghibli's castle in the sky. While this sky hotel does not currently exist, Al Gailey believes that it could someday roam our skies. However, it's important to note that this is a computer rendering of a futuristic concept and not a real hotel. So, keep dreaming of a future where such marvels could exist, because human innovation knows no bounds. Urban Air Mobility System Urban Air Mobility, UAM, is a revolutionary concept that aims to alleviate traffic congestion by utilizing the airspace above cities. It involves the use of small, highly automated aircraft, such as traditional helicopters, vertical takeoff and landing aircraft, VTOL, electrically propelled VTOL, EVTOL, and unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, for passenger or cargo transport. These aircraft are characterized by multiple electric-powered rotors or fans for lift and propulsion, controlled by advanced fly-by-wire systems. UAM is a subset of the broader Advanced Air Mobility AM, concept, which includes other use cases like cargo and logistics. Companies like Airbus are exploring how recent advancements in technology from battery capacity and autonomy to electric propulsion, can drive the development of new kinds of aerial vehicles. By 2030, with 60% of the world's population expected to be urban, UAM could provide a safe, low-carbon, and convenient solution to the growing need for innovative mobility options. Mansory Flying Hypercar Mansory, renowned for its automotive extravagance, has unveiled a concept of a flying hypercar named Empower. This futuristic vehicle ditches wheels and floats in the air when idle or parked. The design cues are borrowed from luxury carbon fiber automobiles and hypervehicles that Mansory has worked on, including Mercedes and Lamborghini. The Empower's large front windows offer panoramic views, and its doors may open upwards, similar to some hypercar models. While the details of Empower are still under wraps, Mansory is also focusing on other vehicle modifications for 2024. They plan to complete conversions for three luxury cars, the all-electric Rolls-Royce Spectre, the hybridized Lamborghini Revuelto, and the Ferrari Puro Sang. This concept gives us a glimpse into the potential future of vehicles.
Monaco 2050. In the year 2050, Monaco envisions a future that is resilient, robust, and adapted to climate change. The principality is committed to achieving carbon neutrality by 2050, with an interim target of reducing greenhouse gases by 50% by 2030 compared to 1990. This commitment is part of a broader climate and energy plan, which includes technical, regulatory, financial, and awareness-raising campaigns. In addition to these environmental initiatives, Monaco's vision for 2050 also includes innovative concepts like the Monaco 2050 Mega Yacht. This state-of-the-art sea craft, envisioned by Vasily Klukin, features a section that can separate as an upper level of the yacht and land directly on the water. It's a symbol of Monaco's commitment to luxury and innovation, even as it works towards a sustainable future. Norway's Underwater Floating Tunnel The marvel of modern engineering, the Rifast Tunnel System in Norway. This undersea tunnel system, the longest and deepest of its kind in the world, connects the city of Stavanger to the municipality of Strand. The Rifast Tunnel System comprises two dual-lane tunnels, the Rifil Tunnel and the Hunvag Tunnel. The Rifil Tunnel, at a staggering length of 14.3 kilometers, holds the record for the world's longest undersea road tunnel. The Hunvag Tunnel, while shorter at 5.5 kilometers, is an essential part of this impressive network. The Rifast Tunnel System reaches a maximum depth of 292 meters, making it the world's deepest undersea tunnel. This monumental project, which began in 2013 and was completed in 2019, has drastically improved commute times, replacing a 45-minute ferry ride with a 15-minute drive. So, buckle up as we journey through this underwater marvel, a testament to human ingenuity and the power of engineering. Starship Super SpaceX's Starship Super Heavy is a fully reusable transportation system designed to carry both crew and cargo to Earth orbit, the Moon, Mars, and beyond. The Starship spacecraft, the second stage of the system, is capable of carrying 100 to 150 metric tons and can travel to any point on Earth in one hour or less. The Super Heavy, the first stage or booster, is powered by 33 Raptor engines using subcooled liquid methane and liquid oxygen. It's designed to re-enter Earth's atmosphere and land back at the launch site. This powerful launch system is fundamental to SpaceX's ambition of colonizing Mars. It's also designed to enable satellite delivery, the development of a moon base, and point-to-point -point transport here on Earth. Space Train Space Train is an innovative concept that could revolutionize transportation. Launched by Emirat Gleases in 2017, Space Train is developing a high-speed shuttle inspired by the Aero Train, a hover train concept from the 1970s. This autonomous shuttle operates on a reverse T-track, using air cushions for sustentation and is powered by hydrogen fuel cells. The technology behind Space Train includes autonomous ground effect vehicles sustained by air bearing and propelled by linear motors powered by embedded graphene batteries. This could potentially bring a new era of efficient and sustainable transportation. However, it's important to note that this is a concept and is still under development.
Verilift Airship The Verilift Airship, developed by Verilift Airships PLC, is a revolutionary all-aluminium airship designed to address traditional airship limitations. This unique craft offers a leap forward in efficiency, durability, reliability, and safety. It's capable of vertical takeoff and landing, operates in strong wind conditions, and requires no airport infrastructure. The airship burns 80 to 90 percent less fuel than equivalent aircraft and flies at speeds between 250 to 350 km hr. It's cost effective, rivaling the cost of truck or rail transport, and has an expected working life of at least 40 years. The Verilift airship is designed for heavy lift applications, with models capable of carrying loads from 50 to 250 tons and potentially up to 3,000 metric tons. The company is currently building a fully operational prototype to train future pilots and attract investment. Vision's Future of Shipping The future of shipping is envisioned to be a transformative journey marked by the integration of advanced technologies and a shift towards sustainable practices. Key visions include the use of autonomous shipping vessels, powered by green energy sources like wind and solar power. These vessels will be equipped with complex digital guidance systems that compile and analyze onboard and environmental data to find the most fuel-efficient routes. The industry is also expected to see a rise in the use of advanced materials and designs to reduce drag and improve fuel efficiency. Furthermore, the sector is projected to witness a fundamental change in mindset, with the adoption of a holistic approach where the health of oceans is considered intrinsic to human progress. This transformative journey is not just about developments in fuels and technology, but also about nurturing a sustainable and efficient maritime industry for both people and the planet. Vertical Aerospace VA-2X Vertical Aerospace, an aerospace manufacturer based in Bristol, England, is revolutionizing the way we fly with their VA-2X, an electric vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL, aircraft. Founded in 2016 by Stephen Fitzpatrick, the company aims to make intercity air travel personal, on-demand, and carbon-free. The VA-2X, launched in 2019, was the world's first electric VTOL aircraft capable of carrying 250 kilograms. It features a unique passive cooling system and a customizable design, which means the aircraft can be made larger or smaller, fitted with wheels or floats to facilitate water landings. With projected speeds over 200 miles per hour, near silent when in flight, zero emissions, and low cost per passenger mile, the VA-2X is expected to transform how we travel. KleinVision Flying Car The KleinVision Air Car is a revolutionary two-seater flying car designed by Stefan Klein and manufactured in Slovakia. This innovative vehicle can transform from a sports car into an aircraft in under three minutes. The air car is powered by a 1.6-liter BMW engine, delivering 104 kilowatts, 139 horsepower. It takes off at around 120 kilometers per hour, 75 miles per hour, after a run of 300 meters, 980 feet and has a cruising speed in the air of 170 km per hour, 92 knots. The air car's range is estimated to be 1,000 km, 620 miles, at a height of 2,500 meters, 8,200 feet. In June 2021, the prototype air car successfully completed a 35-minute flight between Nitra and Bratislava airports. This groundbreaking vehicle was type certified as an aircraft in January 2022, marking a significant milestone in the evolution of transportation.